Hi, my name is Hayley and I'm going to take you through the Kudos Boards integrations with Microsoft Office 365. I'm currently in the My Boards page, which is where I have access to all of the boards that I'm working on both personally and collaborating with my team on. I've come across two Microsoft Teams and I'm in one of the channels that I'm working on with some teammates. This is called Places to Eat and I've added a board to this channel to work on. The board is called Food Objectives and you can see that we have all of our lists and cards in this board. I can work directly on this board from Microsoft Teams. To do that, I have all of the same functionality and I'm going to drag and drop some of my teammates onto specific tasks so they can get started. You'll notice that when I add a teammate to a card or if I make a change on the board, Teams will give me a notification. So that will appear in this bottom right corner as you can see here and you'll also have the notifications appear here as well. This little paper clip here on this card indicates that I've added a file to this particular card. I just wanted to draw your attention to that now before we move across to OneDrive. I've come across to OneDrive and I'm in Places to Eat 2019. The file that I showed you attached to the card in our Places to Eat 2019 board is conveniently located in my OneDrive. This is the case across all boards where you upload files. I'm now in the SharePoint site of Places to Eat 2019 and I've added a SharePoint page for where to eat in Melbourne. And I've added the board that we've been working on. So directly from SharePoint, I have the option to work on this board as do my teammates. So we've come to the last main point of integration for Kudos Boards into Microsoft Office 365. I'm in my Outlook and I have this particular email, confirmation of supplier pricing, that I would like to add to a board. I'm going to come across to more actions, select Kudos Boards. It has the title of the email. I'm going to select to include the email body. And here it's made a suggestion of a board that I might like to choose from, but I'm going to type in invent a new type of solar panel. I'm going to select the list that I would like the card to sit under, and I'm going to select create. This will give me an option to open in boards. I'll do that now. The email will pop up automatically as a card. I can see that here. And if I close that, it's also sitting here as a card added to my list. 